Hello and welcome to 5 Minute Math. Today we are looking at the third grade concept of quadrilaterals. This is standard 3.6b in the great state of Texas and we are using item number 8 of the 2022 released star test. If you haven't done so already, please go ahead and take a moment to pause the video, work this problem out on your own, unpause it, and we will look at our answers together. So we have three different shapes here. We need to find a word that best describes all of these shapes. So let's get into some definitions. All right, so up first, F says these are all rectangles. Okay, so a rectangle is several things, okay? Uh, so it is a polygon. Remember, I'll define it here. Straight lines. and it's closed, no openings, okay? A rectangle is a quadrilateral, which is a four-sided polygon to be specific, four sides. And it has, it is a uh, parallelogram A rectangle is a parallelogram, which means it's got two sets of parallel, and this is just our mathematical symbol for parallel lines, two sets of parallel lines, and it's got four right angles, four square corners. Well, I don't think this is going to work. I think for these shapes... They are all polygons, they are all quadrilaterals, but I don't see two sets of parallel lines on any of them. On, on these, I see one set of parallel lines right there and right there. This one's got right there and right there. This one's got right there and right there, but then the other two are not parallel. They intersect. And I don't see, okay, this one's got two right angles, but not for the other ones don't have any right angles. So definitely not a rectangle. Okay, so let's check what is a rhombus. All right, so it's got some of the same things. It is polygon. We've already defined that. Straight line, closed. Uh, a rhombus is R quadrilateral. So four sides, uh, which we're good with both of these. Uh, they have four equal side lengths. So all four side lengths have to be equal side lengths. And it has also has to be a parallelogram. So it's a special parallelogram that's got four equal side lengths. So it's not a parallelogram is not going to work. And look at these side lengths. Definitely not going to be a rhombus either because they're not all equal. All right, let's check a trapezoid. Trapezoids are polygons. Uh, we know that's good. Uh, they are quadrilaterals. Okay, so with four sides, we know that's good. Trapezoids only have one set. That's different. Parallelogram is two sets of, of parallel lines. It only has one set of parallel lines. And that's it. That's just what makes trapezoids themselves. And take a look at this. I've got a set on here. I've got, we call these the two bases. The two bases are going to be parallel. So yeah, trapezoid looks pretty good. Let's check our last one, parallelogram. And we actually have kind of defined a parallelogram right up here. Right? It is a uh, quadrilateral... polygon, which we know both of those are going to be good for this, but two sets of parallel lines. And we know that's that's not going to work. This has only got one set of parallel lines. That's what makes the polygon, uh, the parallelogram, not work here. So we do have three sets of trapezoids, so our answer is H.